The Florida Atlantic Owls are once again putting the university on the national spotlight. The small co-ed cheer team coming in first at the national championship in Daytona Beach tonight. WPTV's Joe Lopez talked to some of the members ahead of the competition. SAU cheerleaders competed in the sport's biggest stage. This at the National Cheerleading Association's Collegiate National Championship in Daytona Beach. You can't compare anything to Daytona. Not only are you going against schools from all around the world, you know, you're, you're going to put your, your name and your school out there. Some 70 FAU athletes and three of the university's cheer teams took to the mat as they competed for the championship title. And let everybody know that, you know, not only are we good in football, basketball, but cheerleading has it, you know, got, got it going on at FAU. Captain Jonathan Escudero with FAU's large co-ed cheer team says they've been working nine months to put on a two-minute, 15-second routine. Cheer is ext it's extremely hard. I've played almost every sport growing up, and cheer has been the toughest sport I've ever done. It's been a lot of sweat, heart, and tears, but we've pushed through. Also competing, Brianna Pope with the all-girls team. We're all-girl, we're beast, because we could do it without the boys. Pope is a senior and says the exposure from March Madness and having three cheer teams at Nationals is taking FAU cheer and the university to the next level. It shows that FAU is a big school and like we deserve to be there and all of our teams are doing amazing this season, so we're really going out with the bang. Joel Lopez, WPTV, FAU. News Channel 5.